Canada believes that China is an increasingly disruptive global power and will continue to address uh, the challenges of the Indo-Pacific here at NATO but also at home and that's why also we increase funding for security in the Indo-Pacific. Well, of course, we followed very closely President Xi's visit to Moscow and, and uh, we are, of course, afraid that uh, China will offer additional help for Russia and Russia's aggression against Ukraine. And I think it's very uh, important that we have a common response to that. It will be today very important to listen also our, our Indo-Pacific friends and, and how they analyze the situation, what are their proposals. I think this NATO Indo-Pacific cooperation is important. Oh, right now, the, the key focus is the war in Russia and Ukraine. And New Zealand's perspective is that uh, China should use its influence on Russia to see a cessation of war, a withdrawal of troops, a return to internationally agreed boundaries in order for meaningful peaceful negotiations to commence between Russia and Ukraine.